Now, he now said we've it. had a human mermaid. How about some human squirrels? Oh, it's all going on on the one there show. <laughs> they may not be furry, but they are very, very cute. They Here's cute. Kevin Duala spending some Kevin time. Kevin Duala, you said earlier. <laughs> that was a lovely gag, that With one. a bad new branch <laughs> of the scouts. But this one is just for little Only ones. Only for the little ones. From camping to hiking, and from canoeing to abseiling. Almost half a million young people in the UK take part in scouting activities every week. I can still remember, I must have been eight or nine when I first joined the scouts and they taught me safely how to build my first fire with two bits of wood. Still got a special place in my heart, that memory. Until recently, you could only start scouting at the age of six as a beaver, moving on to cubs at the age of eight. But now there's a new animal in the scouts club the squirrels. It's the first time in more than 35 years that a new division has been launched and it caters for four and five year olds. They've recently opened a number of squirrel groups known as Drays across the UK and one of the first Welsh squirrel groups is here on the outskirts of Blackwood in South Wales. Club leader Gareth Haywood has been with the Scouts for over 30 years and has overseen the launch here. Why was it important for the Scouts to, to set up a division catering specifically for four to five year olds? Uh, there's a saying, you catch them at the start of their story, you affect the end of their story, and you're building, you, you've set that foundation in place for them to build on in future as, as they move through the, the sections of scouting. This area, like many others, where squirrels branches have been set up, has a high number of families on low incomes. So the groups try to give the kids experiences they might not otherwise have access to. Today, they're getting creative with clay sculptures. What kind of things do you like to do? Making things. What flavour ice cream is that? Chocolate. Yep. Through the activities, the kids learn important lessons like fire safety. You enjoying your marshmallow? What did you toast it with? The fire. Is that, is, that, is that not dangerous to do that? No touching. No touching. Exactly. So the kids are clearly happy. But what do the parents make of Squirrel Scouts? Before you started Squirrels, he's quite reserved. Very quiet, shy person. Come to Squirrels, he's just improved everything. He's talking a bit more as well because it helps with his speech. How many squirrels have you got here? Three. Three? Yes, I have a five-year-old boy and four-year-old twins. Real enthusiastic about coming, they'd have it daily if we let them. What every scout works towards is earning their badges, and these squirrels are about to get their first one. The feel-good badge for learning about feelings and emotions. You all are gonna get a badge! Yay! The scouting movement may have started over 110 years ago, but coming here today has shown that they've still got the ability to reinvent themselves and cater for families from all different backgrounds. And I hope these squirrels will get as much lifelong pleasure out of scouting as I did. Well, I will be, I'll be signing Ted. I yeah. was going to say, that's it, gone. That's got him written all over You it. did actually say that earlier. What's the youngest yeah. age? Is there one near us? <laughs> that's it, we'll take it.